I carefully routed the wire on these marking lights through the back and into the little channel so they didn't get pinched when they were installed. These screws are stainless steel, so they won't rust like the last ones did. I ordered marine grade heat shrink connectors along with this crimping tool from Amazon. Once crimped, I used a heat gun on the connector to make it watertight. This flexible conduit helps to protect the wires between the tongue of the trailer and where it plugs into the vehicle. I carefully fed the wiring harness through the channel on the tongue of the trailer. This trailer gets used a lot in the wintertime to tow my Ventrac, and it's definitely rusted from the road salt. Applying dielectric grease to where the ground meets the frame helps to make a better connection and keeps it from rusting. I spliced into one of the brown taillight wires to get power from my front marker lights. This multi-wire connector lets me connect a single wire in one side and two wires into the larger side. That way the brown wire is reconnected, but I've also spliced in my white wire. 